Hey guys, it's Julia. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm sharing my tips for all you fine and thin haired girls out there. These are things you absolutely need to know if you have fine and thin hair. If you are a subscriber to my channel, you know that I have really fine, thin, straight hair that does absolutely nothing. So I have learned every trick in the book that you need to know in order to master the fine, limp hair. If this is your first time stumbling across my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below and check out all my other fine hair videos. I have them linked in the description box down below and I really hope you guys find this helpful. All right guys, let's hop straight into the video. Okay, so my number one tip is products are your bestie. So the sad thing is, is that we luckily do not have thick luscious locks that do anything the way that we want to. So we definitely need the help of product in order to fluff up our hair a little bit and give it a little bit of something. So you can check out my um, favorite products for fine hair video, which I will put right here. Or I also have my daily hair care routine for fine and thin hair, where I share a lot of the products that I love. But this basically, you're going to need all the goodies like dry shampoo, which is like I'm basically in a romantic relationship with dry shampoo, um, mousse, volumizing mousse, sea salt sprays, hairspray, um, a good volumizing shampoo, all that good stuff but you're definitely gonna need product to kind of give yourself some help all the way from the shower to when you're finished so get your kind of product squad going and check out those videos to see which ones really work for me right so the next thing unfortunately is to be super gentle and I never really realized this I highlighted my hair a lot I colored it a lot I would use a lot of heat on it and I would just be like oh my gosh my hair is so thin and fine and it's breaking and all this stuff well I finally figured out that if you have fine hair it really just can't handle a lot of anything so really keep the coloring to a minimum try and embrace your natural color whatever it is or make it work right now I'm more at a balayage so I have a darker root with a little bit of highlight just to kind of brighten up my hair but I really try and keep it to a minimum okay sorry my camera died and my dog Noah has now decided to join so don't mind this little cutie just to sum it up just be gentle all the way across the board and don't overdo it any color heat processing or anything all right so my next tip kind of rolling off of that is only use heat when you absolutely need to ways that I do this and my tips for you are to embrace kind of your natural like way of drying your hair so I let my hair air dry about 75% of the time and I really see that that makes a difference in the growth and it really grows faster and it stays so much healthier when I don't blow dry it every day so I only blow dry and curl my hair on a very special occasion maybe if I'm going out for dinner going out or going to a party or something like that when I really need it to look on point so save the heat for really special occasions so in terms of when you are applying product you want to make sure that you apply it on the ends of your hair for fine hair just because if you apply too much at the root chances are if you have thin hair I know for me oil is like my biggest issue so I do apply like maybe um, a root lifting spray or like a texturizing root spray to my roots after the shower um, but other than that I keep everything pretty much here down so that'd be texturizing sprays beach sprays stuff like that so make sure you're not overdoing the products on your roots which could cause more oil my next tip is to only apply conditioner to the very ends of your hair so you might already be doing this but for me I know I cannot bring it anywhere near my roots or my hair it just amplifies the amount of grease and it really really makes it flat and lifeless so make sure to keep your conditioner also from the ends down okay next tip is to make sure that you have the right haircut now everything that I've learned so far from trial and error with my fine and thin hair is just to keep it simple honestly like I always see these amazing pictures of all these layers and bangs and like fun different cuts every single time that I try to go for one of those or I have tried to go for one it just never works out like it might look really cute when my hair is right out of the shower and it's freshly blow-dried but like that is not realistic that it stays like that for very long so I've pretty much just decided that having a really simple clean cut is the best for my fine hair because layers I feel like one you can't even see them so you end up just losing like thickness and volume by cutting layers that 
you literally can't even see to bangs I've tried really hard if you like watch my channel you know I have bangs right now and I'm growing them out but I tried so hard to have these bangs and I literally took as much hair that I could for my head without sacrificing like all the volume of my um excuse me without sacrificing like all the my hair on my head and I just like I literally I'm done like I'm done I can't make them work I think the end of the day like they just don't work for fine hair and I've literally am at the maximum amount of hair I can take I use the product I blow dry them the right way and I just feel like they're I'm not getting the result that I totally want so yeah they might look cute but it's never gonna be as good as like I want it to be because of my hair type so I've just let go of that dream and I am not cutting bangs anymore so now I just keep a pretty simple haircut I keep the edges clean and I try to keep it blunt so it gives a little bit of fullness and other than that just keep it simple All right my last tip of course is like the obvious one but it's hair extensions which I have in right now so my real hair so this is my real hair so it's actually pretty long but it's so fine and thin I just feel a lot more confident and like I have a lot more thickness when I have hair extensions in so these are the Luxie hair extensions and I have a video about all about these on my channel I will link it for you guys or put it somewhere here on the screen so you can go check it out but that is of course a last resort um, if all the previous things haven't helped you to kind of get the most out of your hair alright you guys that's gonna be it for my life-changing tips for girls or guys with fine and thin hair I hope you guys enjoyed it let me know what you thought of this type of video down below in the comments I would love to say hi to you and give this video a thumbs up it really supports my channel and I'll see you guys in the next video bye